No, we didn't see it. Um, some of the guys might have, but I didn't. Um, he hadn't really said too much, but yeah, disappointing for him. But um, yeah, he's getting a scan later tonight. Um, and then obviously, yeah, they'll send it to the people that need to have a look over it in the next um, day or so, and we'll find out more. But yeah, at this stage, that's all we sort of know that, um, yeah, so just fingers crossed for him. Hopefully it comes back positive for him and, um, and yeah, he can get back out there. Yeah, it was just something in warm up. I think when we, yeah, we'll throw on the ball. So that's yeah, that's about all I know. I don't know what uh, specifically happened, but yeah, something so um, so small, you know, and it's kept, it's kept him out. So disappointing for him, but um, yeah, like I said, fingers crossed that um, he gets some good news tonight. Yeah, I mean, initially we were very flat, as anyone would know, knowing that he can't get out there with the boys and and help out. But I think um, throughout the day he was up, he was up and about, moving around and. You know, helping us when we came in and um, trying to keep us up in the, um, up in the room. So, no, he he's a um, positive guy. So, um, like I said, yeah, fingers crossed for him, and um, we get some good news. Yeah, tonight or tomorrow. Yeah, I think yeah, the pitch probably didn't um, deteriorate as much as we probably thought. Um, watching it from yesterday, we thought maybe the cracks might opened up a bit. It might have been a bit up and down, but all in all, it played pretty well. Um, the spin didn't really change too much from yesterday to today. It played pretty well. So. Um, I think just from a positive point of view for our team, you know, just to stick at it all day and, um, and, and get them into a position where we pretty much got them all out where they had to declare anyway. But um, I think that was a good positive that we stuck at it. Um, it was warm conditions, um, tough work out there. But, um, yeah, it was nice to see the boys get through pretty well tonight. Um, and we'll go from there tomorrow. I haven't even actually thought about it. Yeah, I was too worried about just um, putting the pads on and going in as night watchman again. So I was a little bit nervous myself, so I didn't really worry too much in the rooms. But like I said, I think tonight's, um, once he's got the scan and we know more, I think that'll determine from obviously the doctor's um, point of view of what he can and can't do. Um, I think that's probably the big, big thing at the end of the day and mate, just looking after his welfare. So we'll see how that comes up tomorrow and we'll just go from there. Yeah, he's obviously, yeah, he's, he's not 100%, but um, I think the good thing was he stayed out in the field. Um, he's bowled throughout this match um, when needed. Um, so he's obviously, yeah, a work in progress with how he's travelling, but, um, yeah, he's, he's still run around in the field. Um, so similar, we'll just be assessing him over the next um, coming days, see how he pulls up um, tomorrow from obviously spending all that time out there. But... Um, yeah, at this stage, similar story is that, yeah, we, we don't know until, you know, yeah, the next couple of days how he's assessed. But, um, yeah, it was just good to see him out in the field and he, he still put in when he needed. I don't know exactly when he did. He's pretty, um, he's pretty quiet and, 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 and pretty strong um, character. So um, when things always, even uh, now and in the past, have always popped up that um, he tries and keeps it pretty low key. Um, he, he, all he was thinking about was being out, staying out in the field backing up the boys, being out there with the lads and, and being able to contribute as much as he could. Um, so personally, yeah, I don't actually know. Um, he's kept it pretty close to his chest. Um, so, yeah, it was, it was just good to see him out there. Obviously, you know he's in, struggling a little bit, but, um, yeah, to see him still fight and, um, and bowl when needed, I think it shows, yeah, good character that he still wants to put in for the team and be out there for the boys. Uh, it's hard to say, isn't it? Like, everyone's different. Um, I'm always very positive, and he, from what I've seen over the last couple of days, he's been very positive as well. I think, um, and that's that's a good way to be. He's just he, all he's worried about is just contributing for the team and doing what he can. Um, and I think that's um, that's a good attribute to have, isn't it? You know, to, just to get back out there, get on the horse, and help the boys out. And I think, um, yeah, like I said, we'll know more over the coming days. But um, yeah, his contributions over the last couple of days, when he hasn't been at his best. Um, yeah, it's been great, um, great for us and obviously backing us up. Yeah, I think, you know, it's just, it's just about being patient, isn't it? I think that's the big thing. Um, we know when we have those um, collapses and we don't bat it, we're not at our best, that it, it does come down to patience. Um, yeah, and we've got we to gotta do that again. I think the boys started very well tonight. It was disappointing to lose a wicket, but I think the, the other two out there, Finchie and Hetty, showed, you know, a bit of patience, you know, watch the ball hard. Um, and you can still score runs as well along the way. So it's just about um, sticking at our guns tomorrow and, and, and see where we go. It's obviously a lot of cricket to be played over the coming days, but I think one good thing for us is just seeing the wicket how it played today, the difference from yesterday. There wasn't much. Um, if we can turn up tomorrow and it, and, and it plays pretty similar um, to the last two days, then it gives us every chance you know, to, to do something special. And it's going to have to be something special, but I think... Um, 
yeah, there's enough fight in this, in this team to, to be able to dig in and, and give ourselves a chance. So there's a lot of work to be done, but I think, you know, tomorrow night is going to be the telling factor that um, how well we can go and get through to then, and uh, we'll see where we go. Yeah, um, JL came to me yesterday in, uh, in warm-up. Um, you know, I haven't played yet. It was in 2010, I think, the last game was. So um, something I haven't really thought too much about. I enjoy playing it. It's only been probably the last 12 months I've played extended part of T20, but I got to go over to England and Canada, and I'm enjoying it. Um, yeah, so it was a nice little, um, yeah, nice little chat uh, yesterday morning. So we'll see how we go. But like I said, there's still a lot of water to go under the bridge before then. Um, but yeah, nice to be around the side and just enjoying being back around the Australian cricket team. So whatever format that is, um, I'll, go, yeah, I'll go out there, do my best and see how we go. But um, yeah, concentrate on this game first and hopefully um, yeah, I've got a bit of a part to play in this match. Yeah, I think it's just, it's probably been in the positions that we've been in as a team. You know, that he, he's been able to bowl when his team's been out in front and, you know, we've been under pressure, so it does make it a lot easier to bowl when the, when the opposition is under pressure. Um, his team's put him in those positions, though, which is great as well. Um, so that's, that's, that's been the tough thing for us, that, um, you know, we've been, have, have to be very um, defensive, been under a lot of pressure when we've gone out there and faced him. Um, but credit to him, he's bowled superbly. He's put the ball in the right areas, he's been patient, he's been consistent. Um, and, he, uh, yeah, you know, he's had, a, he's had a lot of success throughout. So, yeah, credit to him. Um, it's, um, he's done a lot better than uh, a, lot, a lot of fast bowlers have done in this, um, in this uh, obviously, these two venues. So, yeah, credit has to go to him, you know, that he's worked hard and, he, and he's done the job for his team. Well, I didn't. I was still disappointed that Mitch Marsh had misfielded. So <laughs> I was still angry. I had my hands on my head and I was disappointed. But, um, no, I think, yeah, obviously Starkey, I think Starkey just went to chase the ball. Um, as, as you do, and then sort of realised halfway to the boundary, it's not going to go here, so he chased it a bit harder, and yeah, obviously, as I hadn't, um, had, hadn't even looked at running down the wicket, and I think, um, as a young kid, my coach always told me, you've got to run hard until it goes over that rope, so yeah, that's obviously disappointing for him, but um, yeah, and a, a nice little reward for us early on. Yeah, it does, I think um, we, we, we tried a few different um, Theories at different stages. Um, we tried a little bit last night, um, different field placements and um, bowling different areas. But yeah, it, it does make it hard when they are, they are so far in front um, and they're controlling the game. It does make it hard. And I think you know today we went back to just trying to dry up the runs, build a bit of pressure, um, and go from there. And I, you know it was a, it was a long day, but I think it, it worked for us in the end. We weren't getting a lot of um, benefit from the from the wicket. Uh, there wasn't a, a lot happening there, so but you got to credit credit to Pakistan as well. They they batted superbly um, to the situation of the game. Um, they had time and yeah, they, obviously they had a lot of momentum coming from their bowling innings. So it's um, it was hard work, but yeah, credit to all the boys. I think we everyone that you know got the ball in the hand, dug in, tried their best. Um, f we fiddled with the field here and there, um, but yeah, we. Uh, we tried <laughs> nearly, nearly everything we could, I think, so it's, um, it's just one of those days. But like I said, to get them in the position we did at the end of the day, um, whether they're going to declare or not, we don't know. But to be able to get those last few wickets quickly, at least put them under some pressure with the decision they're going to make.